Okay, so just pulled into Cox and there's like a line outside. Kind of crazy stuff. Anyway, time to go exchange my modem. Can't forget my coffee. There's a line outside of Cox. Wonderful. It's a busy, busy place. Checking in my modem. So they gave me this piece of plastic with, I guess, part of my serial number on it. Oh no, I'm sure. Yeah. Still busy. Like they just opened the door. Oh my goodness! New modem! Goodbye, Cox Building. It is time to go to work. All right, back in the car. It's about time to go home so I can go to work with my new modem and proof of modem exchange. Goodbye, Cox Building. doesn't give you any idea about how far away I live from anything. I don't know what else I can tell you. Uh, but anyway, getting close. Brahms and McDonald's. The only two fast food chains out here. 10.35 a.m. And I think everything that my car can tell me I need to do is going off right now. Low fuel and change oil. <laughs> 25 minutes to log in. Hopefully I can get my modem set up in time. We'll find out soon. So to give you an idea of how small and just out of, in the middle of nowhere my town is, I'd like to introduce to you Hera, Oklahoma. Yep, this is downtown Hera. It is popping off this morning at 10.35 a.m. Almost home, almost there. That's the old middle school. They've been redoing the football field by my house, which has always been interesting. Check it out. Yeah, football field of dirt. We're gonna get AstroTurf, so that's awesome. All right, last turn to my house, and then we get to set up everything. Dead end road. And we are home. All right, now it's time to hook this thing up. Ooh, my office closet. Yeah, and this must be where my motor goes. Instructions. Free stuff I already had. Yay. New Ethernet. And I always wonder why customers say they don't have an extra Ethernet. I do need that though. Modem. Power. Alright, this part's always the hardest because I've got a lot of crap. And I think that is it. Yeah. Hopefully, come on. There's a plug in, I can't tell. Maybe this way. There we go. Uh, modem has power. Okay. Did he? All right, let's see if this thing is working. All right, well, according to this, we are in business. I guess we're going to find out. Is it just me, or is this coax cable just, like, really fancy? It's got, like, carbon fiber ends. I don't know. Waiting for router to boot. Boot live. Check in the router. All right. And let's see. Well, it's better than yesterday. Work computer doing the same thing. All right. That is at least usable. Well, and then it dropped back down. I guess I'm switching VPNs again. I'm not making very good time here. Oh well, we'll figure it out. Okay, well, unfortunately, the new modem did not fix the problem. It seems that the problem is with my wiring outside. So this is probably one of the most in-depth downtime videos that you've ever seen, but as you can ask Sal, I guarantee you that he will agree with you because he's gotten some pretty interesting videos as well. Uh, I'm waiting for my appointment. My appointment is tomorrow evening, which is great, I guess, because by the time they actually get me back up and running, it's going to be almost time for me to log out. So we'll see how that goes. Hope this uh, entertained you.
and uh, that you have a better day than I do. You're at least connected to the network, so that's always good. Anyway, I'll see you later. If you need anything else, let me know. Later.